We interrupt your local broadcasting to give you this severe weather advisory. Ding, ding, ding. Hey everybody, welcome back to Simple Diversion. My name is Graham. And my name is Rob. And today we're gonna to be talking about this little guy, the Cinco Vegas Classic. Bear with us, uh, it is gonna storm here in a little bit. So oh yeah. Hopefully we can get this whole video in and not get wet. Cinco is five. Correct. A lot of people say five Vegas, but it is actually Cinco Vegas. Sounds better. So it's it's getting a little creepy. You might hear some thunder in the background. You know what? It's pretty nice, so it's been pretty warm. Yeah. And this breeze is feeling awfully good. Yeah, you got a little burnt, didn't you? Yeah, the uh, the coloring <laughs> in your TV is not off. I was Get this thing at out. Aaron Hills, and I got a little sun, so I'm, I'm definitely feeling that. But a couple days will be a nice tan, but for now, it hurts. Yeah, I bet. Oh, barnyard smell for me on oh, yeah. the on the dry. Mhm. Mm this cigar is going to be from Nicaragua. 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 It is a torpedo. It has a nice Sumatra wrapper. And it's a 6x54? 6x52, which is kind of misleading too because they, oh. you know, you're going to cut some of that okay. off. But So it's actually a little bit smaller. Nice thing about a torpedo is nice if you, you can cut just a little bit off and if you don't have a nice draw, maybe cut a little bit more off. Wow, I'm getting a lot of cream just on the draw there. Ooh, that's really good. Yeah. These go for about four to five dollars a stick. A stick, yeah. So they're kind of like an underdog. Yeah, they're. Are they, know, are they trying not, to make a name for themselves? These they've days, been around or? for the last couple of decades, oh, and wow. on Cigars International, they do have a ninety rating. It's a really good cheap stick. Definitely that, reasonable. You know, can hit the spot. On Facebook, we put you know there's going to be an underdog cigar, and this was it because you just it's not a big name. You don't hear a whole lot. You think of cheap cigars when when you think of it, but they are they're a treat and they're one of my favorites, especially on a budget. Yeah. You can get a whole box of twenty sometimes when they're on sale for sixty bucks. Yeah. That uh one of my favorite smells. The rain on the hot cement. There you go buddy. Thank you sir. In the first couple draws, I'm getting very rich, creamy smoke with some deep notes of tobacco. I need that too. It's lighting this thing on fire. Here comes the rain, baby. Here it comes, baby. Some gentle spice in there. <clears throat> this is going to be a medium body as well. Yeah, I think we're gonna have to raise our voices in a little bit to talk over yes. the rain and the thunder. <laughs> this will be fun. Never had a storm video. At least we do have a little bit of cover here. We have, uh, I have just this little porch that's covered. Yeah. That's Sometimes nice. when you're close to the edge, though, you do get a, if it's a windy, you get a little bit of splatter. Yeah. The whole week it's been off and on rain. Yeah. And it's gonna come it's until to all weekend. Through the weekend too. Yeah. Rob and I are supposed to go golfing this weekend. Yep. Hopefully it doesn't rain for that. There's a chance that it might, so we'll see. Yeah, early in the morning, so we might miss it, or the rain might miss us. Very creamy and a hint of toast, that's what I'm getting. <laughs> After I smoke the single Vegas, it's good. I get a lot of that baked bread in my mouth. Too. Yeah, okay. Toast, baked bagel, yeah. bread. Right. And it lingers for like pretty much the next day, and I know some people don't like that, but I kind of do. It's like. It's so thick. Yeah. The smoke like in this is so it. thick too. I, can, I feel like I can chew it. It's really good. Yeah. All right, we're gonna smoke this down a little bit, and we will check back in in a couple minutes. All right. Here comes the rain. Are we okay out here? Yeah, we'll see. You sure? Seriously? I don't know. <laughs> we're gonna keep pushing along here because I don't know how much time we're gonna have. Seriously, I don't know. Uh, <laughs> start tailing or oh, tea storming. Poop. We're not very far, but burn line got a little wonky, so I touched it up a little bit, but not a big deal. How's yours been? Yours looks pretty sharp. Mine looks pretty sharp. Um, 
on the palate, I'm, I'm starting to get a little a little bit of uh, like a nutty flavor overpowered yeah. on that toast. Starting to come in a little bit. I get the deep tobacco, some nuttiness, a little bit of spice off yeah. the finish, but the smoke is very chewy in my mouth. When I say that chewy, it means like it's really thick, like you can almost chew it. And I, I do get the baked bread right now, or toast, either yeah. or. Yeah, either or, same thing, same difference. Very good, very, it's, we mentioned it's a medium body, yep. but it's got a lot to offer. With yeah, it does. A uh, variety of flavors. Especially for the price. I mean, that, that price blows my mind. Mm -hmm. So, I mean, this could easily be a, I mean, an eight to ten dollar cigar. Yeah, I mean, four to five bucks. Mm -hmm. It's a bargain, and it is pouring out. It is. I love it. I love the rain. You know, it's been about what ninety degrees today. So yeah. Maybe it'll cool down right. a little bit. Well, hopefully, it doesn't ruin the video. As long as lightning doesn't strike that big <laughs> tree over there, we're good. I'll take a video for you guys while we're filming. I don't know if you'll be able to see it though. Yeah, and just like that, it let up. <laughs> but I got this huge tree. I better watch my ash. And it goes over like yeah. four lots. Jeez. There you go. Oh yeah. Alright, enough of that. Growing up, I was terrified of thunderstorms. Really? I'm more I'm more worried about them now than I was as a kid. Yeah, well I yeah. Because I, I, I know you could die. You know, I know about death. Before I ash myself this time. I, I'm really liking this. I love it. Yeah, thank you. I would put this in my top five cigars. Really? So obviously, you know, we I would buy it again. I, I put it in my top five cigars that we've done videos on so far. Okay. That was scary. I'm not gonna lie, guys. That was scary. That was close. We might have to cut this Ooh. short. I think I crapped my pants. <laughs> <laughs> I might have peed a little bit, and now I have a hernia. Oh what are we doing? <laughs> Let's finish this sucker. F and A, Cotton. F and A, man. <laughs> the heck was that? Did you feel that? Yeah. It was like a thump. Wow, that's kind of scary. Hopefully you guys are safe and sound watching this in the confines of your little home. Yeah. While we are risking our necks to yeah. bring you this. It's actually brightening up too, so I wonder if it's going to clear. Yeah, my this whole video is going to be us smoking, talking about this storm almost killing us. I saw the lightning. Well, I was waiting for it. <laughs> Ash is very, uh, very, eh, it's pretty white. Holding on great. It's not flowering or anything like that. Construction of the cigar is pretty good for yeah. what you're getting. Some thin veins in there. Some veins, but some invisible seams. I, yeah. yeah. It's very well constructed. It's got a very loose draw. I like that. It's like the thunder is about to start and then it doesn't. I do prefer the Toro size to the Torpedo because I feel like I get a little bit more... Alright! Well, ah! Alright guys, this was the... Uh, this was the uh, Cinco Vegas Torpedo. Let us know if you like it. We are getting the f*** out of here. Oh yeah! Sorry for freaking out back there. It got a little hairy, to say the least. Mm. And we thought we were just gonna go in and take cover because that was really close. That was spooky. Yeah. I don't know it, how you guys felt it over there or if you did or anything, but we yeah, felt it coming. It was moving along quick, and I'd like to just thank the Cinco Vegas for being so good. Because yes. if it was anything less, I think we would have just thrown it oh, and yeah. went inside. Yeah. But we, we, we stood we, out here for a little bit and we did not want to waste it. So now we'll just give you a little bit extra of what we think of it. We're about halfway down, I think, almost. Yeah. How are you guys? <laughs> Everyone has a memory, right? Everyone has memories, mm -hmm. I shall Let's say. Let's have dementia. Um, but, but most of us do. Most of us do. So, what is your greatest cigar memory? 
That's really tough because I feel like anytime I'm smoking a cigar with friends, yeah. It's a good memory. Yeah. You know, it's hard to pick that one point because I enjoy smoking cigars with you. I enjoy smoking yeah. cigars with somebody else. Yeah, other friends. I enjoy smoking cigars with everybody together. But so Rob, myself, and then a bunch of us guys are in a fantasy football league, a yes. dynasty league. And every year we have a draft here at my house. We all come together and we have our, our laptops and we do the draft. Yep. And then afterwards, we go out to the patio, we have drinks and we have cigars Good and we times. talk trades and all that, yep. like right off the bat. And I think that's one of my favorite memories is just getting all the guys together, having that those talks. And yeah. My favorite time smoking a cigar, I would say was when we were sitting at the end of the pier, up at the cottage, okay. with our legs dangling. Into the and water. Then we had uh, Adam there and us three were smoking a cigar. So that was fun. Yeah. That was fun. It's hard to pick a favorite. It's just anytime I it have is. a cigar and good company, yeah. it's a great memory. It makes conversation. And that's something that we really enjoy about cigars is in a time of such, you know, social media is just so big nowadays. It is. A cigar kind of is a throwback to people just having a conversation yeah. and interacting. And that's a reason why we like interacting with you guys, even though it is through social media. Yep. It still gets us to talk and to have conversation yeah. and just share things in life that we're going through or sports or whatever it may be, where we're at with life. Yep. And that's what I like about cigars. It's a relaxing time to be with friends and to just catch up Yeah. and to be real. Yeah, definitely. And mm. a little spicier. Yeah. Still very thick. You're great. Yeah. It's not going to overpower me, but yet I don't feel like I'm smoking nothing, you know, it's not too mild. Mm -hmm. I think it's really good middle of the road body cigar. Yeah. Very enjoyable. All right, guys, we're gonna smoke this down. Hopefully stay dry. Hopefully you guys have a great weekend coming up here. Stay safe. And as always, we will see you soon. See you soon. Yeah.